Hello, thanks for tuning in. Today I'm going to show you how I built the 3D grate. I'm making a second one now. One for the multi-stage gasifier, which has a bigger diameter. It's one 140 millimeter pipe, so the thing is going to be like 130. And it's going to have eight steps and therefore seven gaps. And I made six strips from five. And then half a millimeter down each strip. And the last one, the last two layers will be the around two millimeters. Two and a half, three, three and a half, four and a half, and five. So it's steps wise increasing the area because of it's going to have a height difference. And then the charcoal bed. The idea is that it's more uh, spread it out all the, 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 all the flow. So let's weld it together and let's check it out. So here we are. As you can see the height is getting stepwise smaller and smaller. As the diameter decreases. And I made a little, little, little stand for it so it can stand on the crate, crate of the gasifier. I think you can see it from here. You see that there's those concrete rods, concrete steel rods. I just stand on there. This thingy here, the pipe is a piece of stainless chimney pipe I put in there for a sleeve to protect to more uh, temperature. The inside of this pipe also seems a little yeah, it's most carbonized tar, I ex expect. But it radiates quite some as it melted the... Uh... Oh, look at it. Oh, wow. Oh, it's all gone. <laughs> Funny. Glass. So this upper part could also have some extra isolation. But that will be another episode. I'll be back placing the crate inside. So we're back and it's inside, centered, pushed against the upper wall, as you can see. And I have to remove this side cover for maintenance purposes. But it's inside in the end. Let's put everything back back together and see how it does and we're back again gonna check out how the three day grate is gonna work I made this new kind of lid just like the other gasifier this works pretty good Hope for the ash removal things I could use it it's really nice it uses uh, fire rope with fire seal and you squeeze it and then it will dry up and it works amazingly I'm gonna check out how it's gonna function and what pressure differential is achievable for a certain amount of flame first you have to start the engine
Zero stars. No stars. Hooray!